okay uh next one is the simple uh free space of uh ofdm orthogonal frequency division multi spacing multiplexing qam system here uh, system design is very vast and very uh, complicated and to draw in this system we have to use a one part that is called subsystem so how we create this subsystem i am going to tell you here or i am going to present you how to create this subsystem and what is in the subsystem so subsystem means this type of connections which is very hodgepodge and which is very complicated for the circuit so we can uh, combine it in a particular box that is known as some system and you can give particular name that's it is a transmitter part or receiver part or xyz name you can uh, give so main layout is this type and if you click on here then it will be show you the what is the inside the subsystem so let's take uh, one example i am here already taken a bit um, error test set then in one is a qam block you can right click hand here and find out the qam but richer amplitude modulation so qam richer amplitude sequence generator you can use for this or you can use a transmitter component and or other sequence generator like that so here i am using just qam sequence generator so other components also available like pulse amplitude modulation dpsk pulse position and so on so based on that just i am taking qam and this qam is directly given to the ofdm modulator so again you have to right click here and ofdm and ofdm modulator transmitter library so this type of ofdm modulation then ofdm modulation modulator measured so ofdm modulation i am using here so output of the qam is directly connected to the can it can be directly connected to the ofdm but if you visualize the consolation diagram of your qam so you have to connect one electrical constellation constellation visualizer so for that you are going to use four uh, right click find So one cross two or one cross n, whatever you want. So it is available in the by two libraries. To here, uh, for loop control and so much different type of electrical uh, components is available. So I am using for to split out the uh, signal into two part and each part having same value, whatever that other part. So one part is given to the OFTM signal means I component and Q component given to the OFTM block, and second part is connected to the electrical constellation visualizer. Constellation uh, diagram to see how the constellation diagram is seen. So here, if my diagram is uh, or my design is so vast, uh, so my diagram is look like this. So here optical uh, OFDM. After that, we have quadrature modulator, then Maxender modulator. Then we generate uh, electrical signal with the help of this laser and modulate that and use again FSO channel as a VLC channel, or you can you go for the FSO channel for the range of one kilometer and greater than that. So this type of uh, section can take so much complications. so just we are going to create here the optical uh, subsystem sorry uh, in the optic system uh, one subsystem so for that you just uh, select the components and these two components are going into the subsection so right click here and you are getting the create subsection subsystem option so just click on that this is converted into this format 
so your qualm signal is going into this subsystem and output of the subsystem is connected to the OFDM but your electrical constellation visualizer is not connected here so for that you have to uh, double click on subsystem this is your subsystem and uh, inside this subsystem you can see that these two terminals are not connected to the your constellation diagram and there is no option so just go here means right hand side of system first one is the monitor tool and second one is the output port tool third one is the input port tool so if you want to something add into this subsystem to use input port tool and if you want to take output from the subsystem then use uh, output port tool so just click on that and keep it in upside or any other side when you uh, go on go on the edge of that block the si signal is converted into such type of symbol so i am going, clicking it up here and one click is here one output and second click is here second output now right click now i am going to connect first terminal to the that particular output node and second to the second node now it is over now go to the main layout from here should be I think it is hang oh, okay so now come to the main layout now you can see here two terminals are appear and you can connect this visualizer through these two terminals So like that, you can connect uh, an, another terminal also to the your constellation visualizer. And when you run the system, your constellation diagram all appear at that particular uh, visualizer. So for example, So in this way, you can uh, summarize or you can collect all the components that is very complicated or so much wiring is there. So you can do like that and convert into a subsystem. And if you can rename that subsystem means like a block one, block two, or if it is transmitter part, so you can name like that. This is an amplifier part. This is a splitter part or visualizer part like that. So 